promise to God, I follow her intuition. So I tell her I got her with pride or intuition. Hello, people, and welcome back to my channel. So today, yes, I am painting myself green, and please do not mind my phone for being so rude and going off. But so in the holiday spirit, I decided to paint myself green and become the Grinch. So I'm just gonna walk you through how I did my Grinch makeup. And yes, this whole video is sped up only because if not, we'd be here for a good hour, maybe even more. But I'm going to be using CC Beauty's cream base um, face paint and I mixed the green and black together to create a dark green for the eyebrows. To darken up the eyebrows a little bit, I'm going in with straight black and I'm just going to create little strokes to look like hair. So now that we have the eyebrows kind of sort of how we want them, we'll go in and do some extra things later. I'm going to use my Morphe Dare to Create palette and I am just going to create a little bit of a eye look and I'm going to use these greens and shimmers. Every color that I'm going to use on my eyes will be from that palette. Oh, well, look at that. I'm a liar. <laughs> I'm sorry. I also used the Juvia's palette, that nice shimmery green, uh, right underneath the eyebrow. So now we're going to start filling in his nose and start adding a little bit of the details in the face, starting with the line from the nose to the lip and then starting at it. Ooh, start adding in some of the wrinkles in his smile lines in his face. Or would you be or would they be frown lines since he's kind of always. Well, I guess it would be a smile because he always has like a a creepy, not creepy, but evilish smile on his face so for all the details in the face I am using that black and green mixture that I showed you earlier in the video just to um, clear just to let you guys know because I didn't say anything because I'm so smart but yeah and I'm going over it to make it a little bit darker with some black and some areas so just throwing that out there
So now I'm going in with a black and I'm just going to create a little bit of shadowing for his, well for the um, smile lines and the wrinkles. Now we can move on to the forehead and start adding the frown lines and all that other good jazz to his forehead. Well, I keep saying to his like I'm a guy, but to my forehead, jeez. I need to get my life together and get my whole, this whole speech thing is not working out for me. It never works out with my voiceovers. I'm so sorry. And again, I am using that black and green mixture that I showed you earlier. So just throwing that out there just so you won't be lost to like, oh, okay, what color is she using? Is she using black or what? No, it's the green color, guys. Yes. Using the same dark green, I'm just adding a little bit of shadowing under my lip. And then I'm taking a fresh brush with a little bit of, uh, uh, a little bit of black eyeshadow. And I am softening up the edges of my shadowing. Okay, taking the same brush with the black eyeshadow on it, I'm just going to add a little bit of shadowing to the frown lines in, in my forehead. And also taking a little bit of black face paint just to deepen up the lines a little bit. Using that same green, dark green that we made, I am adding a little bit underneath the eye just to give it a little bit of a under eye shadow or, you know, a little bit of bags underneath the eyes. You know, the Grinch can be tired, I guess. But I'm also taking that color and I'm also adding a little bit down my nose and right, um, right by my tear ducts. And then I'm taking a black and I'm adding just a little bit of lines just to give it a little bit of a, um, I guess you would say like a texture look, I don't know. Something like that.
So I'm going to take the black paint and I'm going to just create the dots right above my lip. I don't know if they're like the whiskers or I guess we're going to call them whiskers today. But we're going to create those and I'm also going to use that dark green, a black, and a yellow. And I'm going to do like little light strokes to create some hair, well, to make it look like there's hair there. And a little bit of texture on the side of my face. And I'm also going to do that to my chin and the other side of my face. Using more black eyeshadow, we're going to do a little bit of shading around my hairline. I'm also going to dip into the white face paint and add a little bit of a highlight to my cheeks and underneath my smile lines for the face. And add a little bit of white into the eyebrows just to make them pop a little bit more. Now I'm going to take my Beauty Bakery powder, setting powder in the color, I think it's banana or no, it's yellow, in the color yellow. And I'm going to set a little bit of my face so it doesn't look so freaking shiny. Again with the dark green, I'm just going to add a little bit to my bottom lip and cover my full top lip. And then I'm going to go in with this pinky peach color also in my... CC Beauty um, cream based makeup palette and I'm just going to put a little bit on my bottom lip. To finish out this look we're going to use a little bit of eyeliner in my waterline and some of Bomb's Co Bomb Cosmetics liquid eyeliner and then we're going to go ahead and throw on some eyelashes since the Grinch is known for his beautiful long eyelashes. I hope you guys liked the video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Merry Christmas. See black peas.